three numbers is no big deal for me. Still remember like 30 digits of pi off the top of my head. And we have new enemies here. I believe these guys are new. We have, I can't remember which ones are the if fish, uh, but there are definitely if fish here uh, that we have seen before. I think this guy that I'm fighting right now is the if fish and then the one up is the upgrade. Get back here. Damn it. And I think that is the dino fish, to be honest with you. And we got blue drops. More freaking drops. Let's put them all together. Let's move them over here. That was a lot of damage that she did to me. These, these guys are not... Uh, are not easy and they can frosty you of course because what would a drop be now without some debilitating status effect uh, you might be thinking to yourself that you might be able to make it uh, to the next town without the defense upgrades I would not recommend that uh, and this is why I'm going to be cutting out blue drops from now on I will show you every new drop as we come across it but seriously this is becoming very, very annoying. This was only one guy to start. And we've had to kill, what, like six of them? That is no good. No good at all. I don't think there's actually... Yeah, this all leads to the same spot. So let's just head down here. It's a pretty straightforward path in this place, if I remember correctly. Uh, let me take on the freaking... This guy up here. This is the dino fish, if I remember correctly. Even though I should be focusing on... How did I miss? How did I miss? Seriously. I'm saying right on him. I'm swinging a giant axe. And now I'll be cutting out the blue drop. After entirely too long, we are ready to move on yet again. This place is... Well, the blue drops is really the problem here. This place is not that... Are you kidding me? The first freaking thing. Like I was trying to say before I got interrupted by a blue drop, this place is not that complicated. It's pretty straightforward. There's no winding pass. There's no treasure chests. There's nothing like that. We just need to move forward constantly. And these dino fish, they launch missiles, which I don't think I will ever understand, but they do that. You know, magic I understand. That was just a missile that came out of its dorsal fin, and there's a blue drop down there, and I can fucking see it. The, I mean, seriously, this each of those battles is probably taking me about a good uh, 30 seconds to a minute uh, to take on one of those blue drops. It is becoming very, very annoying. Um, and that's if they don't really uh, split that much. Uh, like, if there's like three of them, it'll take me like 30 seconds to a minute. If there's more, it takes me longer. Uh, so, that that is the main reason why I'm cutting it out, like I'll be doing right now. Okay, that had to be about five minutes, of course, after I talk about how long it takes. It takes even longer. I uh, did switch the weapons around, because everybody got a weapon level skill up after that. Um, Jake is now back on the Claymore. Nothing more he needs to level up. Yancey is on the low javelin, so that Yancey can chuck that at people. And then Xion is on the chain whip, and I think that is the last thing that she needs to work on. And then uh, Yancey has a little bit of work with the javelin and uh, the whip. No, I think that's it for Yancey too. So we are moving on fairly quickly. Yes, Dino Fish. Like I had said before, these guys are not that difficult. Usually three or four hits is all that it takes. And that's not too bad unless they start casting magic. Then it does get a little bit more complicated. And it looks like uh, the, the Javelin is casting Balloon on the enemies, which is always appreciated. How did it launch a missile out of its back? That is what I want to know. And it's also, yeah, it's spaced out, which is what the balloon is, I believe. Die. Yeah, that's, see, that's not too fucking tough. All right, let's move on. We can head up here. And, are you kidding me? Okay, when it's spaced out, though, um, I, I shouldn't have too much difficulty with it now that I can space it out. I'm apparently supposed to be relying on those uh, side effects from these uh, from these weapons in order to take those guys out. Uh, but when it's got when it when we space it out, 
but it can't replicate itself, which makes it very, very easy. And I can still hit it, which also makes it uh, very easy. I can hit it while it's spaced out. And now, if that guy would die, that'd be appreciated. How did I miss him? And of course, it's just like, okay, we're gonna replicate 20 times now. Yancy, get over there and hit them. Yes, hit them. Damn it, Frost. How am I missing? I'm right, I'm pushing against it. Damn it. Oh, I'm cutting this out then. Don't like cutting action RPGs for the random encounters, but sometimes you just, you just gotta. Let's head up here though, and we have found the resistance. Who are you, Imperial spies? Hardly. Wait, Jake can talk. Gemma told us about you. Welcome to the resistance. I'm Jake, how do you do? Wow, you're a woman! Why are you looking at the camera for this, Shion? You're supposed to be looking at her. I am not a woman. Stop looking at me like that. Jealous? Knock it off. I'm Dilux girl. You know Dilux? Of course. Why? A Dilux been draining people's energy at the ruins to the east. Like in Pandora, but why is Dilux? Something must be controlling him. We'll check on that. See, they automatically assume that Dilux's now a good guy. They're just like, no, nah, everything, yeah. No, he, he's he's a good guy, I'm sure. And now let's all walk off in random directions. I like your camo pants. How you doing? Chrissy's dad found the resistance when he was caught. She kept us together. She's only 18, but she's brilliant. Brilliant. Yes, she, yeah. Thank you for the useful information, dude. Uh, good luck. Well, the trouble started about 15 years. You, that's really it? Come on. NPCs, tell me something good here. I got nothing. Chrissy had to grow up too fast. Oh, it's so sad. Let's just get out of here. Wow, this is a giant ass house, let me tell you. The Emperor has some powerful bodyguards. Sheiks, Geshtar, Fanha, and Thanatos. They're capable of anything. So we've been fighting the Empire this entire time. They really have not made that clear to this point, to be honest with you. Uh, motivation is very questionable as to what we are fighting. The Emperor is using his troops to find us. That is probably not good. Probably not good. Can I talk to, to you? Let's get moving. She's the only one not moving! You're the one that says let's get moving. You stationary statue of a bartender. What the hell is wrong with you? Can I talk to you? For a second I thought there was a different term for like a female bartender, but there isn't. People are sure busy in the rooms over there. A bartendress. We should call them bartendresses. It's fun playing war. Not when there's a real war. Oh, people, man. The people in this town. What the hell is going on here? The resistance's base is well disguised. Not if you say it at the storefront. This is supposed to be the front, isn't it? What's up, little kid? Aw, oh, she cries at night. That's so sad. Yeah, that's supposed to be the storefront. Don't talk about the resistance at the front. You use code words. How, why am I teaching them mafia tricks? Seriously. Okay, this town, South Town, and the Gold Isle, you say. You fought the Republic. Plato's Republic? Probably not. Probably not. And now it is time to purchase more equipment. Didn't we just do that? Yes, but as you saw there, we actually kind of needed it. Uh, we do have upgrades here. I do need to purchase three frosty rings, which are upgrades from the golem rings. Uh, these will give me plus 16, well 16 uh, total defense, which is better than the 13 uh, that we had with the golem rings. And then I do need a tiger bikini, and yes, that is only going on to Shein. I don't, I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. Uh, that gives us, uh, that gives her, I should say, 64 defense, which is better than the 43. That is such a huge upgrade. 43 to 64, and it is female fantasy armor. The less of it there is, the more defense it has. It totally makes sense in a tiger suit uh, for the. Well, I assume the boys and the genderless. Let's go with that. 
So two Tiger suits, that'll give you 64 total defense as well, as opposed to the 43 on the Ruby Vest, and also three Tiger caps. Am I going to... Yeah, be able to purchase all of this, no problem. And I don't think I used any items along the way, so I will equip this, and I will sell what I have equipped. And I'll see you on the other side. All right, that is all done, and I have uh, rested at the end so that I am back to full health, so that you don't have, I don't have to cut again when I take care of that. Let's explore around town a little bit here. Uh, I did misspeak, though. The, uh, the tiger suit only gives you plus 52 uh, total defense, not, not 64 like the tiger bikini. So the suit is not as good as the bikini. Why can't they just make, like, a tiger speedo? I don't understand. And this little kid is lost in the only freaking park in town. I can't find my boy! No, no. No. That, that, how ironic would that be? She's, like, standing around that I can't find him! It's always like that in the freaking games, though. What am I talking about? Let's not head up here. This has no door. How, how do you get into these buildings? This is like the second time in a row where it's just like, nope, can't get in there. She's acting strangely all of a sudden. She turning into a zombie. Yes, thank you. It's the capital of the empire. It is the biggest place around here. Did you walk all the way over here? Damn you, NPCs. You're supposed to stay more or less stationary. Uh, here is the end. This is where I rested. There is something else here, though. We can head down here, and there is Watt, along with a girl down here. Make yourself at home in the blacksmith shop. Sure, that's exactly what I wanted to do. This town smells like war. Found any new weapon orbs? I don't think I have. I have not. So, no point in talking to him now, but if you... Uh, still haven't leveled up a couple of your weapons, you can go to him. As you saw there, I'm still at 13,000 GP. That is not bad, considering that I just had to buy two rounds of equipment. Seriously, dude. The freaking NPCs, they walk around so damn much, it's hard to keep track of who I've talked to. 